This is a uh, really nice breakfast. It's nice to have some some avocado toast. Mm -hmm. Good morning and welcome to Saturday. Saturday. This is the sort of thing we generally do on a Saturday or a weekend too. Mm -hmm. It's just kind of relax and do something nice like this. Uh, I'm getting something in me now. This is just a little breakfasty thing. I'm going to be meeting up with Dan in a little bit, actually. Me and Dan are going to go shoot something. And if I explain what it is, it will spoil it. So I'm not going to explain what it is. It, it's, but it's just a tiny little something that I think will just add a little extra uh, to something that we've created recently. So... It'll be nice to hang out with Dan a little bit. We'll also, uh, me and him are going to grab some lunch. You're going to stay here and just work on some stuff? I need to do a test for my December painting. Okay. Because it's something I haven't done before, and um, I have to do a background and then do it. And I'm worried that if I mess it up, I'll have to repaint the background too, and it'll put me behind. So I'm going to do a test. Okay. Well, if you want me to like bring you back something. I'll let you know. Or okay. let me know when you're getting ready to head back or whatever. Yeah, yeah, we can we can do that. Dan, you know, I just really love this view. It's just a good view. Me and Dan came out here for no particular reason, just to just to soak it in. Yeah, shoot some birds. Yeah, we uh, we've taken up bird watching and uh, Yeah, we haven't talked about that uh, lately, but we love birds. Dan's favorite bird is the gull. The big horned gull. Uh huh. And Steven likes the red bellied whippersnapper. Yep, it's true. A lot of people don't know about the whippersnapper. They should. Then now they will. I'm not sure what's what's happening anymore. It's it's uh it's game night and everyone's using the the same background because there's backgrounds now um we're having pizza tonight and um this is going to be a kind of an interesting flavor profile because this is mushroom and artichoke heart uh we thought we had pepperoni well i guess we technically did have pepperoni but it's been in there a long time turns out you don't make food for like a month month and a half uh the stuff goes bad so the the pepperoni was bad um but uh the Mushrooms and artichoke hearts obviously still good, and I've I've had mushrooms and artichoke hearts on pizza, but I've never had them as like the the only toppings. But it was nice to make a pizza tonight. I mean, it's good. It's um, it is weird. I kind of miss the pepperoni on there. I think it's because artichoke hearts like. I feel like they need to be balanced out and the mushrooms aren't enough to balance this out. So it's kind of a weird pizza. If there was a bunch of other things on this with the artichoke hearts, it would work. But as it stands, just the artichoke hearts and mushrooms, the artichoke hearts are like super overpowering. But the pizza's good. And it's nice to make a pizza again, so I'm, I'm still excited. <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> it's Australia, Mike. It's such a great drawing. Now I, like, now I want to play GTA. It's the dumpy. It's so I, good. And then I send it. Oh. Then I send it right into the ditch. Oh. Santa rides into Australia on a mining dump truck filled with festive <laughs> trappings. Yeah, I'm not as good at drawing as Haley. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? That's the, that's the same image. <laughs> The exact same image. Why is, why is Santa's different. red eagle? Why is he doing this blitz? <laughs> what is that dump truck hauling? I sit. <laughs> That's how my stick figure sit at all. Finally, I'm, I'm asking you to not make fun of them. Oh, Ooh, that was a fun night. We realized, not tonight, we realized, uh, when did we realize this? A few nights ago? A week ago? Sorry, my <laughs> cable was stuck on my chair. We realized that um, Christmas Day falls on a Saturday, uh, which is always really exciting because it gives us even more of an excuse to create 
a Christmas themed or holiday themed episode of something for Stephen and friends, we generally, not always, but generally put out some sort of holiday themed something around the holidays. Uh, we've done GTA online. We did animal crossing last year. So we've done, you know, we usually do something, um, but I don't know. It's extra special if it can actually come out on Christmas day and it's going to be Christmas Day. So we decided, we we're trying to figure out exactly what we wanted to do. And we said that it had been a while since we had done holiday themed broken picture phone. So that's what we decided to do. So there will be a very special, very memorable episode of Broken Picture Phone. 40 minutes of funnies coming your way on Christmas Day. And, uh, you know, from our little, uh, what do they call it when you have your, your, Chosen family, from our chosen family um, to, uh, to your family, we, we hope that you enjoy it. And if, you're, if, if your family has children under the age of 15 or something, you probably don't want to <laughs> let them watch it. Because <laughs> as with most Broken Picture Phone content, it contains uh, quite a bit of, a, of adult humor. But it's funny, and uh, I, hope that, I hope that it makes your, uh, your Christmas just... A little bit better. For now, I'm tired. I'm really tired. Um, I had a big day because me and Dan were out for a little bit. Um, and it was fun to, to go out there and do what we did, but I'm tired from it. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm still catching up on sleep. If I'm, if I'm fully honest, I, I, I am. Even though we've been back now for a few days, it's still... It's still a process. I'm still trying to get sleep every day and, and try to use that to catch up and feel better. So tomorrow's another day, and I hope I feel even better tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Let's meet back tomorrow, shall we? Oh, yeah. And he's cute. He's just really stinking cute. I mean, look at that little guy. He's just resting. Yeah, I'm talking about you. Oh, you gonna roll for me? Oh, big stretch. Big stretch. Good boy.